Hey, what's good? It's Tommy G out here practicing positive form on a daily. Because whatever you put out in the universe, you will get back. So why not positive? Woo! TGIF, man. Next week, we headed to that beach, South Beach. So I had to give me some 10 minutes of sunlight, 30 minutes of exercise. You know, uh, I already ate some green, but I'm going to eat another uh, I'm gonna eat a salad tonight. So, yes, sir. Just got through eating the peach. Man, where are the peaches and nectarines? Uh, somebody need to tell me when they come in style. They, been, they feel like they've been out of uh, season for like two years now. Been kind of feeding for them things, man. I need to go to Sam's Club. See if I can find me the big bag that I used to get. But uh, I just found some at uh, Walmart. What's good with the nectarines and the peaches, man? That's one of my favorite fruits. That, mangoes, pineapples. So make sure y'all... Uh, Stay hydrated, man. It's hot out here. Make sure you drink a lot of water. Uh, yeah. Get ready to hit that beach. So get these steps in. Because uh, if you don't get them steps, steps ain't going to get themselves. You know what I'm talking about? I know I'm going to go a little late. Man, I've been running errands. Trying to make sure that I'm up on par on everything that I got going on. And make sure I stay uh, nice and right. I still take them ginger shots every morning. I make this ginger shot. Uh, hit me up if you want to know the recipe. Uh, I put a little, a little extra in my uh, ginger shot. So, uh, yeah, man. Boy, big. Boy, I got big uh, Tesla uh, panels on, on this house. I'm trying to get like him when I grow up, man. But yeah, daily affirmation. I would not. Focus on the things that I can't control. I will not focus on the things that I cannot control. I will not focus on the things that I cannot control. Yeah. I say that to say this. Some people are depressed because they have been in a situation where the situation is over. And no matter how much they think about it, it's not going to come back. No matter how bad they want a situation back. It's not gonna happen. And uh, some people can't get out their funk. It's like being in quicksand, man. The more you move, the deeper you get in it. So I say, stop letting things control you that you have no control over. And if uh, that's one thing that got me out of my mental funk when I was down and out and uh, uh, I was just thinking of ways to fix, the, fix things in a situation that I was never gonna be in again. So when I start focusing on the positives and the present, the things that I could control, uh, that's when my mind opened up. That's when my, uh, I, the, the sadness stopped seeking in, you know what I'm saying? So it's like going through a heartbreak and uh, you find out the relationship is really, really over. And no matter how bad you want it back, it just ain't gonna happen. And if you did get it back, it's not gonna be the same. So, man, focus on the positives. Focus on the things that you can control. Make sure that you're dieting. Make sure that you, uh, when I say diet, I'm not even, I'm not just talking about food, but food is, now, uh, is a big important thing. But make sure you're cautious on the things you read. Cautious on the things that you put out in the universe. Cautious on the things that you watch, to listen to. The people you listen to, the people around you, all that energy you feed off of. So if you want positive energy, put positive things in your life. And uh, and y'all know me. I like doing horror movies, but I also like doing comedies. Horror thing, I don't know. I just, I got this thing for the zombies. And, uh, Quentin Tarantino, when he do gore, you know what I'm saying? I just found myself watching horror movies and I didn't consider a horror movie unless somebody got killed in it and uh, I thought it was weird for a long time but it's just uh, that's just what I like man it's the horror uh, I like comedy I like making people laugh I like horror comedy I made a horror comedy and it's on DGR TV it's called Nightmare on MLK Street I'm about to get back to work man so I'm sitting focus on really doing some good films 
for really putting some good films out there for people, you know what I'm saying? Really showing y'all my skills, because really, the movies that I got out, they cool, but they, they ain't got nothing on what I got what I got going on, you know what I'm saying? Even in this book that I'm writing, uh, y'all gonna love it. It's a, uh, it's a horror book, but it's dope though, you know what I'm talking about? And uh, I can't wait for y'all to read it, uh, get reviews, and different things like that, man. And uh, we got some good stuff rocking, man, on DTR TV. I just, I know I'm skipping because uh, I'm gonna tell y'all to download it's free on Roku, Fire Stick. Uh, Google Play and Apple Store. Make sure y'all download it. We got this wellness thing that we're going to do. I'm actually going to be a part of the show. Uh, just overall positive on just our people. You know what I'm saying? Our people need counseling. Uh, we need people to talk to. Like I was telling them uh, yesterday, I had a friend that did TikTok dances every day. I mean, you would never guess that he was going through something. I call it the Robert Williams, because you know how we just thought Robert Williams is happy all the time, and then all of a sudden he commits suicide, and it kind of throw you for a loop. I had a partner do the same thing, and it go back to you being really happy with you, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you can try to entertain people all day, but if you mentally going through something, it's going to affect you physically. You're going to be tired. Uh, you had a job that I didn't want to work tired you know what i'm saying uh emotionally uh you get to a point where you're tired but as long as you breathing and waking up every day you can start over i learned how to hit the reset button i learned how to focus on just the positive things in my life i learned how to focus on things that i could control and not focus on the things that i couldn't control and my life start being uh better you know uh start putting things out in the universe that i wanted you know for a long time, I felt like I was stuck in a situation that I felt like I couldn't get out of. And I start, hey, I start visualizing myself being somewhere else, and visualizing myself doing something else, visualizing myself being uh, uh, great. And I still got growth, you know? So, still a growth thing. So, uh, I'm gonna get off here, man. I didn't talk long enough. So I'm gonna walk to the store, get me something to drink walk back i just want to get a couple steps in make sure y'all practicing the three essentials which is 10 minutes of sunlight the sun is out it's bright it's 100 degrees out here it's hot i got this black shirt on i'm sweating but it's all good because i love being kissed by the sun 30 minutes exercise you know i'm trying to do 8.5k i do over 30 but i just you know for you it's your 30 minutes of uh, walking in so uh whatever it's, whatever it takes to start Go on and get up and get at it. Make it happen. That's why I say keep it moving. I mean, do so do something every day. And I I recommend the three essentials. But if you can get up and walk or, or walk around your house or do something every day, keep it moving. That's what I mean when I say that. And make it happen. Make it happen by any means. Sharpen your skills. If you got stuff you want to be, you got goals you want to accomplish, make it happen. You got fitness goals you want to accomplish. Make it happen. You got business goals you want to accomplish. Make it happen. You know what I'm saying? And keep it moving. All 2022 is really for the rest. Because this thing is, it's a lifestyle, not a uh, not a habit. I'm trying to turn it into a lifestyle. So I want to do it the simplest way possible. Get up, walk, 30 minutes, you know, eat something green. Simple things that people can do get simple results i used to be 290 i was chunky i look at a picture my partner sent me a picture and i was like is that me back there yeah but you know it is what it is i was unhealthy unhappy focusing on the things that i couldn't control and uh i changed some things and you can do the same uh if you're happy give me some positive energy man you know i got a lot of happy people you surround your, yourself with the people that you want to be like. So I got, got people that's happy. Uh, got new nephews. Uh, got good got good news. I get good news a lot. I love good news, man. Tell me something positive. That's how I always say I always say that. Tell me something positive. Even with my kids, they come home. 
tell me something positive today. You know, let me hear something positive from you. How do you feel? You know what I'm saying? I'd have conversations because this world is telling them to be something that they ain't they not built for. And I'm not, I'm gonna tell them the truth. But tell me something positive, man. Enjoy the things that you have. Focus on the things that you got, you know. And if you want greater, work for it. Get out there and work. And uh, all right, I'm gonna get off this thing, man. Hey, if you haven't subscribed to the YouTube channel, I go 2,000 subscribers right in this first quarter. Download that DTR TV channel and app. It's free on Roku, Fire Stick, Google Play, and Apple Store. You got content. The film festival open again today. It's the third third month. It's ten dollars. You can be on DTR TV for six months. Then we'll renegotiate your contract. Get a Lauren for a chance to win, and then you enter this for a chance to win, like. Film of the year, DTR film of the year. We got a few uh few awards. And our goal is to actually have a film festival. Maybe next year. So we're doing the groundwork. Uh like I say, how you eat an elephant one bite at a time. You know what I'm saying? So and I'm on my ET. You know, I talk about ET all the time. Uh the man that does it every day. So we're doing this every day. We're doing something to the better the channel every day. We're looking for sponsors. Uh, we're looking for content. We got some good content you just want to just put out. Hit me up, man. And uh, I'm going to get at y'all on the next one. All right. Peace.